Hi there, I'm just opening a project which I know the data sources are broken. So I've got a couple of simple layers. Uh, one AOI is just an area of interest. It's, I think it's just one little polygon in Leicester somewhere. And then there's quakes, some earthquake data I downloaded um, from the net. So but you can see it's got exclamation marks and it says click to repair layers data source. I can click on that individually and select where the um, uh, file actually is. You can also go to properties, click on source and set data source. So there's a couple of ways to do that, but that's very individual. What if you want to do um, multiple in one go? I could have 50 layers in here, 100. Am I really going to go through them one by one? What you can do is go to view tab and click on the catalog view. Look at the maps your map element and you'll see the AOI and quakes there. I can select them both and click on data sources. So now you can see it's listed those two. They're two different layers but they're listed, they're detailed in there. And I know it's shifted to D. So what you can do is you can type them in individually here. You can click the Explorer little icon there and select again, or you can go to find and replace. And this is what, this is the best thing to do. So you go to C slash temp to D slash temp, i.e. update the new path um, to, to C temp and D temp. And actually, I don't know why I even, <laughs> Why did I even type that in in full? I don't have to do that, do I? I can just do change C to D. It's, you know, maybe it's just a drive letter change. You know, you're picking up from a network drive now instead of a local. Um, but I can type whatever. So I'll change the C to a D. And now that I've got that, I can run that. And you can see, um, just replace everything or just the next one. And I'll just replace them all. And there you go. It's completed that process. You see it's changed it to D now. And up here you'll see validate and apply. So I validate and apply. It applies the changes. I go to my map and lo and behold there's the data. Anyway, I hope you find that useful. Thank you.